the whole thing happening in Hugo's mind and all these loose ends. Because for five years, Lost wasn't just a TV show. It was like a trailer for a movie I'd really like to watch. Like yeah. the whole fucking thing about Walt's powers and Hugo's thing. Like every week, it's like, yeah, this is going to be cool. And then the ending to Lost actually happened. The ending to Lost was so bad, it made the previous five years worse than they were before. Yeah, It was like... All of a sudden, all these loose ends, all these different directions that you had been heading. Turns out you're just a shit writer. And, and you were like, <laughs> you had no plan from the start. The whole way through, you just fucking sucked at your job. You had no idea. Like, writers are supposed to think about next week when they write this week's on a TV show. And they didn't do that for half a goddamn decade. And... Lost, <laughs> lost was real. <laughs> what happened at the end of Lost? <laughs> Are you passionate about this, Woody? Or what? <laughs> <laughs> what, what did happen at the end of Lost? Is friends with another mom who has a kid in the same grade, and this kid is the polar opposite. He is the captain of the football team. The football team is uh, undefeated, and uh, and I saw this guy, and he's you know heartthrob material. No homo, no pun. Oh, really? <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> yeah, you can't get away with saying something Woody? like that. You, you don't get a no homo out of that. You don't a... <laughs> no, that doesn't excuse You're me. You're like, mm. I saw this guy, and he's a sexy motherfucker. <laughs> no I homo. All yeah. up on that. <laughs> Wallow. Whatever. Would so you open you... mouth kiss him, Woody? I'm trying to paint the picture here, right? This... So, yeah, <laughs> I kicked it when I was in the fourth grade, and I'll kick it today. That's how, that's, 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 this is how it's going to work, Jane. I had a teacher in, in second grade, and I loved her. I thought she was cool, and she was always extra nice to me. And, uh, like, she would let me slide on certain assignments, and I thought it was because she felt like I didn't need to do all the work to prove that I, that I knew what I was doing. And I talked to my mother a few years later, and she thought I was retarded. <laughs> <laughs> no. It's true, yeah, it's true. Her name she was... Uh, yeah, <laughs> she thought I was she retarded. Yeah, well, I don't know if she used to read retarded, but yeah, she thought I was like special in some way. And that's why, like, when she's like, you don't have to finish your multiplication. I thought it was because that we both had this mutual understanding that I understood multiplication so well, I didn't have to do all this work. And yeah, from her no. perspective, it was like lowering her standards for the retarded kid. Yeah, oh my God, that's, that's, I would have never told that. <laughs> 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 Yeah, that, that brings up the mind, like... No, so you were tasting it, I guess, because you'd, like, put it on your wrist to, like, test the warmth? No, it was directly from the boob. Um, is our caller here? That was my next question. I was like, was anyone in here, has the, has, the, has anyone in the call tasted breast milk directly from the source? Yeah, I uh. have, I have, yeah. It was like, uh... Ah, oh, that seems weird. Sometimes I get weird. Like, I... <laughs> <laughs> I love it. He, he has no defense. He's like... Sometimes it gets weird. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes it gets weird up in here, right? There's like, nothing to do but go with. No, we, we we get weird up in here. So, oh, hey, mom, glad you like the show. <laughs>